Welcome everyone, my name is Michael. Today, we are doing something big. This is week 20 of Pick My Poor series. So I figured, let's put 20 of something out there. And you guys voted on 20 wandering ring pours. I am so excited. This is going to be some crazy, crazy, crazy adventure. Um, and I'm going to tell you straight up right now that I am not 100% confident that I'm going to be able to pull this off. But you know me, I love a good challenge and I'm going to do my best to make this happen. Um, all right, so um, let's go into the colors. And... Uh, Let's get this going because we do have to do 20, 20 cups. Um, that's pretty crazy. All right, here we go. Let's go with our first color here. This is the brilliant yellow green. Then we have a bright aqua green. Next is metallic cobalt blue. Then we have a light blue. Then right here is light violet. Then we have metallic purple. Okay, that's that. And of course, we have our titanium white. Um, today, this is Liquitex. Okay, and oh, check it out. We got this giant, giant stick today. So that, that's hilarious. All right, guys, I guess it's time to play my favorite game and your favorite game, possibly the most famous game across all galaxies is clean up the sticks and count them. So let's get right into that. Count along with me at home, guys. Here we go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, and let's count the giant stick. Seven. All right, guys, here we go. Oh, this is crazy. Now, this week we did go a little wild and we did name the color palettes. I think we, sometimes we are trying to do that. And I actually call this color palette Alien Forest. I think it, it, it kind of suits it. And I really do love this color palette a lot. I was very, 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 very thankful that this was the color palette that went along with the 20 ring pours. Because there was one color palette on there that would have been a huge challenge. This one's really nice. This is a lovely, lovely color palette. All right, guys. You know what we do here. I am going to put everything to the side here. Um, I will bring out these cups right here. We are going to layer all of these cups, all 20 of them right now. Um, this is very mechanical looking, but it is my favorite part when editing and watching. Um, so here we go, guys. We are going to go into some nice music here, and I will see you on the other side. Let's go.
right, guys. I'm back in here. Whew. Now, this part, I know I'm going to speed up for you guys. But for me, I don't know. Look, I think I'm probably down. Probably took about 10 to 12 minutes. Maybe. I don't even know. I have no idea. I have no idea how long. I feel like I lost track of time. But that was so awesome. Look at these cups. They're just insane. All right, let's let's move these cups because we're going to need to use them. Let's make some rows because you can see, look, we actually, I don't go in with this huge plan to be super organized because I kind of want to keep it random, but I end up just focusing and doing some nice patterns. So you guys can actually really follow at home. Um, every cup was layered very distinctively. Like these cups had this specific layering, this had specific layering, and they were all the same. So you guys can follow at home. With, this is actually pretty easy. All right, let's move these over. Then we're going to get that. That nice, nice canvas back in frame here. Whew. There's a lot of cups, guys. 20 cups. 20. 20. All right, here we go. Let's see if we just line down here. Should be okay. And you can kind of guess how we're going to run this. We're probably going to try to do each, you know, one each. We're going to one, two, three, four. I think, I think that's the way to do it. I think. I'm not sure yet. Whew, this is awesome. I am so excited. I really am, guys. I'm very excited about this. This is craziness, and I love craziness, so it's perfect. It suits me perfect. Okay, here we go. So we're back in frame, guys. Now, we're going to hop back into some music, and we're going to put this down. This is going to be great. I am so excited. I keep saying it. I'm very sorry, but yes. Very, very, very. This is awesome. Here we go, guys. Whew. I'll see you guys on the other side. Let's go.
All right, guys. Whew, we are back in here again. And how crazy does this look? This looks so great. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right, let's, let's just torch just to pop some bubbles. I know there's some blank canvas in there, so we don't want to light that up either. So this is kind of delicate situation here. Um, cause we still need to tilt a little, but I do want to get rid of some bubbles cause this is going to be nuts. Woo. Wow. She's beautiful looking. I love these colors. Oh, and guys, I did again. I went in with this with not a, look. I wasn't the most confident going in with this, but I also didn't plan this either. And I know that we called this palette alien forest but guys doesn't this have kind of like a tree vibe a little bit like a forest vibe i don't know am i seeing it i don't know all right let's tilt this um i don't think it's going to be that long of a tilt i think let's talk through this it should be pretty easy oh wow all right here we go let's tilt this out guys all right here we go we're coming up Woo! wow it's a lot of paint um, this is very thick though. I went super thick because I knew I had to do the rings. So let's just hope she moves enough that I could fill in some of these areas. See, I'm struggling right here in the middle. I'm gonna have to come up a little. It's gonna be um, it's gonna be a weird a weird tilt session. Let's see what happens because it looks like I'm already stretching it too far. But I see what I want to cover, and I think I covered most of that inner blank canvas here just by even just by going up like that so now I can come back down a little and finish off this bottom because now the bottom is bare and I, I have to remember I also have white in there too so I can't mistake that white for the canvas I don't, I don't want to over tilt down here but I kind of have to get this corner out of the way so let's do that now and then we could bring her back all right there we go let's bring her right back all right, let's center, center this back up again because we need to start going this. Let's finish off the top here. That way we don't go too far in one direction and not be able to come back. And this top is being a little stubborn, but we're gonna get it. Yeah, okay, I got the top. Now let's stretch back a little. Ooh, I love these colors so much. Yeah, I really do. I love these colors. And I don't mind the stretching right now. I think the designs are coming out pretty nice. I really like this 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 style a lot. Oh, I really don't want to have to push this far over. Because she's not as fluid on this side. Even though that was the last section that I probably put paint on. Hopefully we get a quick tilt here. We don't have to waste much. We'll we'll adjust the top. We're not gonna over over tilt that top corner. We'll come back in with some paint so that we don't overstretch. That's not a problem. I see that. I see the top corner right there. We can fix that. We'll fix that. Then we'll torch, and then she's done. Oh guys, that was amazing. I loved it, and it did keep this uh, foresty vibe for me too. So I like it. These colors, I love these colors, and I love these rings developing. I don't know if you guys are seeing it yet, but yeah, there's a little, the, you can see the rings in there. It's nice. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Let's just come back just a little bit more this way. I think, I think I really like this composition right here. All right, I'm putting it down. She's going down, guys. She's going down here. All right, and then we'll touch her up. I'm going to clean up really fast. Oh, boy. Let's see if I could get it right in frame. Oh, that looks beautiful. All right, so I will torch off camera because, oh, look at this. I don't want to get anywhere near this painting with that. Um, um, I'll torch off camera. We're going to go for the close-up, so stay tuned for that, and I will see you guys later. Bye.